हेलो ऑल माय नेम इज क्रश नायक एंड वेलकम टू माय यूट्यूब चैनल सो गाइस जनरेटिव ए आई इज वन सच स्किल सेट राइट नाउ व्हिच इज रूलिंग द मार्केट एवरी कंपनीज आर इन्वेस्टिंग अ ह्यूज अमाउंट ऑफ मनी इन बिल्डिंग एप्लीकेशंस यूजिंग एलएलएम मॉडल्स मल्टी मॉडल यू नो वेयर दे कैन दे स्पेसिफिकली वर्क विद टेक्स्ट एंड इमेजेस कंसिडरिंग दिस आई थॉट ऑफ वाई नॉट मेक अ वीडियो जस्ट टू अंडरस्टैंड अबाउट द जॉब मार्केट ऑफ जनरेटिव ए and here the main aim is to understand like what all skill sets they are specifically looking at and uh, surprisingly after we probably go and see the skill set uh, if you go ahead and see my playlist uh, i am definitely following whatever skill sets are specified over there with respect to that all those videos are also coming in parallel again uh, at the end of the day my main aim is to teach you in such a way that you should be able to crack any kind of jobs uh, let it be with respect to data science machine learning generative ai you want to probably work as an ai engineer so almost everything is probably covered if more than 18 50 plus videos have been uploaded and many people have been able to make a transition so uh, let's go ahead and probably discuss about this particular skill set and see that uh, you know whatever things i am probably teaching whether it is matching up or at least you should get an idea like what kind of skill sets they are specifically looking for generative ai roles as i said huge amount of investments is being done by companies to develop applications in terms of this so it is important that you specifically know all these things uh, i have repeated many number of times uh, over here see i have just searched for generative ai and i have basically selected jobs in linkedin platform i uh, will just go and see what all uh, information is basically given in any job profile what all skill sets they are actually looking at one more thing that i have seen one role you can probably see over here senior full stack engineer right so i i, I said right generative ai just not only for a data scientist or an ai engineer for any kind of profile whether you are working in cloud whether you are working as a full stack web development right so over here also you can see people who are working at react typescript node python sql no sql and cloud based platform integrating both with generative and traditional ai modules as a senior engineer you not uh, you not shape our technical and product strategy to create strong business outcome but you'll also be creating the developer experience so this rapid flare is a company and here you could see like what all kind of skill sets is specifically required for a full stack engineer okay but again uh, other than this there are some generic things that has been written over here, so we will not go through that but uh, if i probably talk with respect to the other job profiles so let's see in flipkart here you will be able to see there is a technical lead gen ai role and uh, if i uh, go ahead and see right what all roles overview it basically want so here you can see primarily focus of the role is to harness the capabilities of large language models and multi model technology for business use cases right the ideal candidate will be able to solve business problem with a deep knowledge of gen ai tech and the relevant application domain this roles require a this 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 in the evolving gen ai field okay uh, other than that more responsibilities that you'll be able to see see deploy optimize develop application using large language models to meet specific business requirements use cases across various uh, business use cases uh, and functions right stay informed about the latest advancement in that is basically happening in the generative ai research and techniques okay um more if you probably go ahead and see over here uh, collaborate with product managers other engineering leads and data science experts see data science experts separately you really need to interact because here the main aim is basically to build generative ai application if i probably go ahead and see with respect to knowledge and all what it is actually looking at ability to write high quality maintainable code and work collaboratively hands on experience with generative ai open ai gemini models or other open source llm models and large wing, large uh, vision or multi models right here you should have an experience with vector database framework such as langchain or hugging face right uh, you need to know how to develop rag generation uh, system in short with the architecture and prompt engineering technique and some more very important thing is with respect to the cloud platform aws azure and gcp so what i see from this entire thing right definitely you should need to have a knowledge with respect to the foundation models how you should basically know how to fine tune this particular model how to use paid and open source models how to use it along with vector databases how to use it along with frameworks like langchain and hugging face and if you probably go with respect to each and every playlist that i have actually created see generative ai on azure cloud aws cloud i have started soon projects will also be coming over here langchain fine tuning aws bedrock this is for aws itself lama index google gemini right open ai all this kind of projects has been created now just imagine you know my video preparation are just not like that i definitely see what is basically happening in the industry where the job requirements are definitely there 
and based on that i definitely make my videos so here almost each and everything has been mentioned and it has also told you to focus on three amazing cloud platforms aws azure and gcp now see guys uh, what we have also done in that uh, i neuron right uh, we have also come up with a dedicated courses right on cloud so this is probably one of the first to cloud platform course with respect to generative ai right i'll be providing you this in the description of this particular video so this is complete generative ai in cloud using aws azure and google cloud so this will be an important one it will be running for 4 to 5 months right uh, every week 3 days classes and here you'll be seeing that how we can specifically work with generative ai in different different cloud platforms like aws google cloud and all so definitely do check it out if you want okay uh if you are not capable don't worry i'll also upload free videos in my youtube channel okay but just to learn in a much more better way to create amazing projects you can definitely come to there let's go ahead and see one more uh, lead architect generative ai roles so here also you'll be able to see you have you must have an intuitive understanding of llms right um you should know the techniques like cot tot you should you know the limitation and possibilities of rag right you know how to fine tune closed source model see fine tuning is very much important because fine tuning you really need to do with your own custom data set so fine tuning closed source model such as gpt gemini and open source models like mistral and llama i have already discussed this you should basically know how to quantize model and know how to host and scale open source smaller models for inferencing so obviously here also google cloud will be specifically required right google cloud aws or azure so that you will be able to do the deployment let's go ahead and see some more roles and uh, here i've just selected some of the roles and again with respect to different different searches also i've done uh, for freshers and all i will also go through that and we'll see which are the most common generic uh, generic skill sets that is basically required okay so here also with respect to the gen ai models what i see champion the use of python as a primary language see python is also becoming very much important collaboration you have to probably work with software engineers data scientists data engineers and all this is a generic one maintaining cutting edge knowledge based on this and uh, here specifically no such things are there but with respect to generative ai only it is been mentioned okay uh, let's see one more thing like generative ai engineers over here see experience in fine tuning model experience of project based on uh, uh, open source llm models experience in natural language processing and understanding familiarity with deep learning frameworks and libraries ability to analyze this 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 scalable gpu deployment experience is a plus a differentiator skill so i'm already doing that guys so if you are probably following my entire playlist i think you should be very much good enough see i'm not lying anything you can probably check out my playlist and over here with respect to this you can basically see it or now see this uh, this uh, responsibilities looks different develop a clear vision for gen uh, gen ai adoption in hr now see in hr tech also specifically gen ai is being used create a roadmap for integrating gen ai into ex existing hr system and processes stay abreast of latest advancement in generative ai uh, lead a team of data scientists engineers and ai specialists model selection training and deployment collaborate with hr leaders so and so oversee the deployment of gen ai models you know define success metrics for gen ai applications perfect so whatever things we are learning through my youtube channel i think you'll be able to see one one more job role we'll see from pwc i think this is also a very good company altogether uh here also you can see lead and manage a team of software engineers engagement see this uh, job role that you will be seeing is for an experienced people i will also show you for a fresher also what all things are basically asked design and implement cloud infrastructure cutting edge gen ai devops python okay these are some of the generic things now let me go ahead and search this one and here i have basically selected my experience level as entry level and associate and now here you will be able to see much more different job description so here you can see develop construct test and maintain sophisticated data set and benchmarking system for llms and generating ai task design implement and manage benchmarking frameworks for large language models implement large scale data ecosystem see it's all about cloud platform working with foundation models fine tuning and all right you can see experience with cloud services like aws s3 aws batch gcp equivalent google cloud storage this all there so definitely i'm telling you guys this is the course that you should definitely go with anyhow if you are capable go ahead with it otherwise i will also be uploading videos um with respect to in my youtube channel right so here uh work there and let me go ahead and search for this lead consultant ml ops generative ai engineers over here so here also you'll be able to see this right ability to analyze fine tuning open source llm models 
generative ai and lm specialist early career so here you can probably see to tech toolbox lang chain right lang chain is basically there it's an amazing framework to create uh, job application sorry generative ai application you should have a research mindset the reason is that you definitely require a research mindset because any new models that are probably coming up you should definitely explore it and see how things are working out okay and again over here degree you can see one two three years practical experience at least two years in machine learning deep learning with project contribution generative ai working experience with open ai google cloud and similar LLM models so from all these kind of job roles that i probably see guys uh, what are the common things that you really require frameworks like langchain llama index you should definitely know to work with both open source and closed so, uh, closed models with hugging face libraries with uh, libraries like langchain llama index you know you should basically know how to create an application generative ai application um hugging face is also one compulsory thing that i have probably seen in every every roles right and definitely know how you can work with generative ai in cloud by using different different frameworks like aws or different different clouds like aws gcp and azure the main aim is probably how to deploy it and how to probably perform a inferencing so all these things needs to be considered and that is what i probably see in most of the job roles if i go ahead and see this and these are the same things that you are probably able to see it right so yes i think we are in the right track just by seeing the playlist if you are following a playlist trust me one or the other day you'll be able to do it once you start creating more and more applications so let me know uh, whether you want me to create this kind of videos even for machine learning engineers or data scientists uh, this was it for my side i'll see you in the next video have a great day thank you and all take care bye bye